Man. Maybe. Struggling still. It's struggling still though. It's struggling. What's going on? Yeah, it's back, but it's still struggling. Hopefully it stops. This is weird. Normally it fixes itself immediately and it doesn't seem to be. Hi, Nate. Welcome, welcome. Well, uh, it might it might die again, y'all. It's actually still dropping lots of frames. Uh, yeah, it's uh, still bad. No, no, thank you for apologizing, Fuzzy. Um, it's still bad. Well. It's dropping a bunch of frames, but maybe it'll be okay. Dropping more frames than it has. Oh no, the jellyfish, what happened? <laughs> it's like, okay. Um, hey, maybe it's good now. All right, we have to, to go all the way down here. Oh. My goodness, that's like the most water I have ever seen in one area. And it still keeps going. <laughs> it still keeps going. Holy moly. Oh. Uh, ow. All right, don't die to the bat. To the cave bat. Timer. Uh, the timer is the total amount of time that we have attempted to beat this challenge. Uh, the challenge is to beat Terraria on Expert Hardcore. And it's my first time playing Terraria at the same time for added funsies. Hey. Hey, look at these. We can get a hook. Yeah, I have lots of new ideas. Um, we're gonna try to, like, really what I need is on the bosses is space, but I need to figure out what's causing the bosses to spawn, because it seems kind of random, but I don't know, it also might be tied to, uh, getting the new types of ore in hard mode, or breaking the, um, the altars, so we need to figure that out. Did you study the tape? I, I understand, so I looked at the, uh, worm damage, or whatever, and when you touch the head of the worm of the destroyer, it does way more damage. I want to see if that applies to just all worms in general, or if that's just something with the destroyer, but that was definitely my problem. I kept letting the head keep hitting me and it did like way too much damage. But the other parts actually didn't do like that much damage. Oh, Jesus, I have six HP. I didn't see the piranha on me. Seeing the number go up by one. <laughs> Welcome, Labrarus. <laughs> uh. uh, biostats. I have an idea about the nurse. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, I'm gonna make the the battle area. Um, I'm gonna put the nurse somewhere else, and I'm gonna see if I can set my spawn. I need to figure out if I can set my spawn with the bed because it said that when we tried it. Um. So I'm assuming that it'll work, but I never actually tested it. So um, we're, I'm gonna move the nurse somewhere safe uh, and then set my recall point there. Oh, I can just right click the torch, let's go. That's nice. Um, and then, yeah, that should, uh, that should allow us to recall and heal at the nurse. 
Oh, go shut up, Dev Life. <laughs> I've never beaten the game. It's the first attempt. It's the first times playing. It's yeah. What do you mean? You oh, I've I, I, I've played Terraria for two seconds. No, yeah, the first second was your first time. Now it's your second time because you already did it one second ago. Like, what the hell is that? <laughs> What was the cause of Laurel 26? Uh, exclamation last death. We fought a new boss and it annihilated us. Um, there's so many different strategies for bosses. Yeah, it does seem like a definitely a really fun strategic part of the game. And I think that's what we that's what we need to do the most. 200 IQ strat, put nurse in the ocean. <laughs> Carl plays Terraria twice, twice. Oh. All right. Um, let's see. These guys don't sell terribly, but don't sell great either. Oh, we have so many, so many worms though. Oh. Getting some life crystals early, which is good. We like to see that. 10 sapphires. Do I have any more sapphires? I have 11 rubies and 10 sapphires. We're playing Pokemon now. <laughs> Two stars. I need more for more enchanted night crawlers. Yes, yes. Excellent. Um, all right. We should explore more. Probably to the left. Why did I stop exploring over there? Maybe that was corruption. I don't remember why I stopped exploring over there. Or maybe I was just dying. <laughs> That's always an option. Uh Honestly, this rockfish might be our best weapon. I think I should use this. That was a sad death. Hi, Lady AT. Yeah, it was. Um, Terraria is kind of Metroidvania. Thank you, Honey Butter. Thank you, Flutter. Those two names rhymed. Mm, all right, I think we need to get more money to... Oh, no, we do have some money. But we're currently using bombs because we can't afford... The luxuries of dynamite. Do I have a piggy bank? I do. Let's get out our bug net in case we find anything to snag with that. The bug net is good money early on, honestly. And it gets me worms for fishing. Whee. I I am confident that we can defeat one of those bosses next time. Unless there's a third boss. <laughs> but if, if there is, it should be the same principle, hopefully. All right, water leaf. Let's collect some herbs. Imagine there's just 30 bosses and it just randomly gives you one. Oh. Carl's fishing hut is in full operation again. When it rains, we're coming back. Uh, but yeah, we updated the spoiler policy a little bit. I'm now okay if people tell me pretty much anything about pre-hard mode, unless it applies like, like after. Okay, yeah, so we do have, we do have a, uh, Corruption, which is cool. We haven't had corruption. We haven't had corruption in a while. Oh no, sorry. We do have crimson. We haven't had crimson in a hot second. Um, I'm gonna try to run through this, though. Oh, I want the worms from that rock. I'm gonna mostly try to just run through this because um, I want to try to get the loot on the other side. It's a little easier to run through crimson, I think. Oh, there could be loot right here. Probably not the play though. Oh god, don't hit me. Alright. I think we're wearing wooden armor, so we just want to make sure we don't take any damage here. That we don't need to. Hey, we got some death weed. Okay. This rockfish is a great early game weapon. I just fished it up. Uh, it's like a mace, I think, but. Or a uh, hammer. But it works as a really good weapon. Oh god. No! <laughs> Damn it! Alright, let's explore the other way instead. Too much damage. No! 
Oh, it's right click. Yeah, okay. I wonder, does that pause the game? No, it doesn't pause the game talking to her. Is there a hotkey to make this heal? No. Or do I have to click that? Is there any way to talk to people other than, so I have to right click her and then do left click on that. Is this a new game? Yeah, we uh, died horribly. So. I think this is attempt 28 actually, not attempt 27. I can't remember. I can't remember if we died immediately or not. The game is fun but makes you rage. We played this again last night, but I'm not doing hardcore. Very understandable. <laughs> Very understandable. All right, we should at least be able to survive through the desert here to explore some new territory. We need to get some more movement items and such if we can. Water leaf. And thank you, shocks. Over prepping for bosses is a good idea. Absolutely. The, the, the real issue that I have with um, the initial hard mode stuff that we're doing is I just don't understand what makes the boss spawn. Um, it felt like my two guesses, and I want to test this next time, but my guesses are it's either mining titanium or one of the ores, or it's smashing the altars. Um, or it's just random. <laughs> we need to we need to see if the bosses will spawn. Um, turtle. We need to see if the bosses will spawn if I don't do those things. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of science. But then in case they do spawn, we also need to prepare. So we'll just try to do both, I guess. Are those okay? Those are just leaves. I hope it's not 71 hours on just this attempt. <laughs> oh, that'd be pretty bad. Now this is another good fishing area. Ooh. Hey, the bat got in anyway. Stay out of here. I'm trying to do some fishing here. Are those guys gonna get in too? Oh, I need to change the design. Oh my gosh, I need to improve the design of this. How do we improve the design? Maybe that is enough. Okay, I have four enchanted night crawlers and a dream of a golden crate. Gonna try doing what Dan did. What it, do you mean the slime thing? Oh. Oh yeah, the pet slime. Inspired me to try it on Hargo. Good luck, red lava. Maybe encompass the whole lake. So I, I learned that it messes with the water if you build in the lake though. Cause um, I just started fishing up junk when I built this uh, lower. Thank you, Diamond. Thank you, Chaos. Welcome, everybody. We have we have new strategies. I'm I'm hopeful that this is the run that we beat one of those starting bosses. A crate potion. I wish I had a crate potion. We just started, so we we don't have very much yet. Oh, chess. Thank you so much for the good luck. Double cod. Does it go by surface area? I don't know. It definitely messes with it if you build a line. Oh, butthead. If you build a line, if, if I were to build this down, like even that, or at least, especially one lower than that, but I think even that will mess with it. Recovering from surgery. Um, Ben, I hope you, uh, hope it's a smooth recovery. Anything I should know before starting a blind playthrough? Um, 
You can turn on auto pause if you want to go slow like me. <laughs> um, definitely ask the guide for. Uh, you can put like the guide that you start with. You can sort of like show items to the guide, and they'll tell you what you can make. I feel like that's the most important thing. Yeah, I wish. I wonder if there's some way to make it so that the slimes can't get under this without actually obstructing the fishing. You're working on a cosplay? Oh, I'm curious uh, what cosplay you're working on. If you don't mind sharing. No worries if you do. These slimes are so annoying. How do I keep them out? Maybe this will keep them out. I don't know, maybe something like that will keep them out. It might not though. Maybe this will keep them out. Maybe that will keep them out. How great the guide is. Yeah, the guide is all you really need. The guide is like, is the wiki that you need. Let's make it higher off the ground. That is a smart idea. All right, let's see if the plan works. Or do we need a new plan? We're gonna need a new plan. Oh, amazingly the plan worked. Miriam Bell from the game Faith, the Unholy Trinity. Making a mask to resemble her appearance in the chapter two of the game. Oh, that sounds awesome. I've never played the game, but I love cosplay. I've done a couple myself. Carl, what is your favorite cheese? Ooh, um, probably Parmesan or Asiago. Um, one of those kind that you might grate and put on pasta. Mmm, cheese on pasta. Hey, said Domino. Carl, let that squirrel go. Ah, it's go. It's get. It's gonna go to a good home. Okay. <laughs> Munster. The other, my second favorite, or maybe still tied for favorite, is feta cheese. Though. Um, oh, the bats are still getting in. What do you do with all this fish? Honestly, I need um, I need food for like the entire run. Um, food is so important. It makes you run faster. It gives you more defense. It makes you do more damage. It seems it just like it seems like it just buffs everything. Um, so it also sells really well. So these get converted directly into dynamite. <laughs> I can literally just sell everything for dynamite. I'm hoping that. Uh, I'm hoping I can get like a golden crate or something too. That'd be nice. Oh, we're out of good bait, so I think we're done here. Melty cheeses like cheddar and mozzarella. Crumbly flavorful ones like good. There's so many good cheeses. Uh, got some wooden crates. Lucky sailfish boots. Too bad I already have. What happens if I put two of these on? <laughs> Do I run super, super fast? Oh yeah, the bomb fishes are also great to get. Let's see. Um, I need to make more platform. How much wood do I have? I've got a lot of wood. Eh. Okay, speaking of which, do I have any food that I can have right now? Because that would be helpful. Got some sashimi. Just in time to get rid of this bat. Um, this thing might be a little annoying. Do I have any grenades? Actually, grenades would take care of this. Explosives are the best. B nades are honestly all I need for Wall of Flesh too. I am thoroughly convinced that B nade is the only thing you need to make to defeat the Wall of Flesh. Just lob B nades at it. 
I think I got this chest and then I TP'd out here last time. I think I haven't been further than that. So let's see if we can get a little further this time. Can we find some new stuff? Oh my goodness, so many big fishing areas this game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! <laughs> that was almost bad. Don't want to do that. These guys out of here. Get them out of here. Get them out of here. Oh, these things give me a lot of money, though. Oh, you butthead. How did he get behind me? The piranhas are coming. The piranhas are coming. All right. Uh. Oh, jeez. Uh, I don't even know what happened there. All right. Um... Well, we're alive, barely. We need to get some stars. We need to get some stars for more fishing goodness. That was a bit scary. But we are still alive. All right. Um, can I make some sashimi? I can't. I need to get enough iron for a cooking pot. Yeah, we need to just like mine a little bit of iron. It's gonna really help. Ooh, a bamboo candelabra. Is this the run of close calls? Kind of is so far. Yo, gamer, thank you so much for the, for the happy partner. Thanks, Roro. Hey, get out of here. All right. Um, hello, friends. <laughs> Uh, I'm not cooking them, all right? I'm selling them to a good home. <laughs> well, the black scorpion actually sells really well. So do the butterflies. How about the turtle? The turtle's pretty good. The yellow miracle, though, is the best. Surprisingly, Grubby doesn't sell for anything. The heck, Grubby. One gold worth of bass. Yes, very really good. Huh, you can actually sell bamboo, that's interesting. Oh, we just want those worms. I right, definitely don't want this in my inventory anymore. Get out of here. Um, this is... Where have I been putting these acorns? I don't even know. Whatever. My first four chests are organized. Everything else after that, not organized at all. Mm. Oh, Budoko, very good to see you. Thank you. So grubby. Is Yoshi holding a handgun? Yeah, I probably should change it for that reason. It's a common misconception. Yeah, no mods. Tis vanilla. All right. What is our fourth chest going to be? Let's see. Our first one is blocks. Second one is ore. Third one is alchemy. Alchemy. Um, fish. <laughs> fish. I'll keep the bomb fish though. Those are probably coming in. Oh no, it should be materials. That's what it should be. Materials. Mats. Wait. This is the alchemy one. This is the wrong one. Now, this one it should actually be materials. Alright. Yeah. That shouldn't be in there. Those shouldn't be in there. Ah, whatevs. All right. Thirty healing potions. That's something. Uh, 
Well, we have almost enough money to start buying dynamite. <laughs> In fact, I think we do have enough money to start buying dynamite. I don't know if we need to... Oh, 23 dynamite in a dream. Let's go. It begins. It begins. Wee. That's 10. We don't want that. Ow, why does that happen? That's so weird when that happens. It just one of those dudes just plops down on your head out of nowhere. What the heck? Okay, let's see if this drains the water at all to drop a dynamite down there. If it doesn't drain the water, we gotta we need to take drastic measures. It literally didn't drain the water. No, it did drain the water. Okay, there it goes. It only drained it a little bit though. Uh, we have some glow sticks. Let's see if we can actually see what the heck is happening. Maybe we can find some good stuff too. Oh, I gotta grab all that loot right there. Yes, please. I never did the test to see if you'll just straight up die. Um, there we go, it's slowly draining. Jeez. Might throw some over here. That would also help uh, drain the water down a little bit. There we go. There's a slime right there. We're playing a little bit riskier. Here, we don't want to hit the jellyfish or the piranhas. Uh, playing just a little bit riskier here. Do, 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 do. Holy crap, look how deep it goes. That's wild. It goes so far down. That's wild. All right. Um, I'm just trying to get rid of the water. Um, all right, so um, we're doing spoilers a little bit differently for today. Um, I am okay if people tell me stuff about anything that's pre-hard mode. Um, I, if I wanna, I wanna do, like we've already done this part of the game several times. So I wanna learn as much as possible. It's because you blew it all up. How many attempts on wall flash? Um, I died the first time and then I won the second time. Uh, is that some iron over there? I would take that. What? There we go. This iron is going to come in handy. So much water, do 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 do. So much water. Right. There we go, finally draining out. There we go, finally got rid of it. Oh, another heart piece. Yeah, we're doing, we're finding a lot. We're not finding much in the way of ore, but we're finding a lot of heart pieces, which is very, very good. Life crystals. We've already got 180 health. That's a very good start because this is pretty early in the run still. Um, let's toss some glow sticks. Is it safe to go over there? Oh, yeah, slime. Ugh. Oh god, there's a dynamite! I thought I tossed a glow stick, not a dynamite! Ah! In my head, that was a glow stick right there, not a dynamite. Oh. I don't even know how that happened. Well, rip Laurel, 27. That's okay, though. We're going to find a pyramid immediately and get an awesome magic carpet. The dynamite desert. 
You can survive it eventually, but not yet. Let's do Crimson again. Um, we've had Corruption so many times. I want to try some Crimson again. Just for a change of pace. The Frisky Court of Bacon. <laughs> I wonder how it generates these names. The names are pretty funny. Tempt counter. Going out with a bang. Uh, if attempting to enter the dungeon before Skeleton Dungeon Guardians spawn, these generally kill any player with a single hit. I figured something bad would happen if you enter the dungeon based on the uh, messages that it was saying. That's interesting. So you just literally can't get into the dungeon. Well. <laughs> Imagine having nice things. Ooh, sunflowers. Right, we got lots of nice, uh, lots of nice trees. If Skeletron goes into the day, that's also an insta kill. I figured that that it might get weird if that happens. Um, because he's so adamant about only doing stuff in the night. Though I'm amazed it's an insta kill. I figured it would just I figured the game would just be like Skeletron leaves. cute pet for our troubles. Thank you. What's this? Oh, bombs! Yeah! Oh, alright. Let's just die immediately. Nothing like dying to a slime. Nothing like dying to a slime. area. We haven't spawned next to an ice area in a while. Um, yeah, spear said nobody ever getting his upon their finding a spear is their first item. Need a bug net. Alright. We're doing a test for science. Man. I'm wasting worms. Get out of here. We're doing a test. What happens? Alright, we're not doing a test. Never mind. Test cancelled. Uh, um, more sunflowers, please. And thank you. Let's put a sunflower like here, actually. Cause it'll be close as possible to... It'll give us the buff for as long as possible in the ice area. Oh my god, that slimes are coming! Run! I have any torches? I should be able to make a couple. Oh, oh, come on. Uh, can I build off of the tree? I thought I saw it. Let's see. Does it only work with a platform? Platforms you can build off of trees, but regular things you can't. That's strange. I'm sort of surprised that's how it works. Oh, another plum. Nice. Alright. This run might be over super fast. <laughs> oh, this looks nice. Wow, an extractinator is the first item. That's wild. 
Well, that could be nice. I guess it's hard to get silt early on. But with all of our explodinating, we're sure to get come across some eventually. Um, do I have any recall potions? I do. Nice. Probably not worth getting this, but I like a nice old fishing pot so I can run faster. Mmm, <laughs> probably shouldn't go any lower in here yet. Player takes too long to kill and Dawn arrives, Skeltron will begin acting exactly as a dungeon guardian and bop your ass. Interesting. Gotta work on my platforming while building. I wanna try building something like right under me as a Let's see here. Here, I'm just gonna do a little practice real quick. I guess I want it if I put it just in front of me. Then maybe I'll jump on it. I want to be able to like immediately jump on it. Let's see, not there either. Become the platforming god. Let's see, it's maybe like this. Oh, I could have jumped on that. Maybe. Oh, even further to the right then. Didn't hit it though. Uh, I didn't actually jump off of that one. I want to get this. Nope. Nope. <laughs> hmm. Should do a little bit of a left right, is what I should do. Almost had it. Now we're platforming. Oh my god, I hate the spear so much. There we go. Something like that. Oh, a fish? What the? <laughs> Goldfish? Um... Goldfish kite? Oh my goodness, let's go. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> That's cute. It's beautiful, yeah. It's beautiful. Alright. That's cool. I always wanted to try out the kites. Huh? Eh, ice physics. Everybody's favorite physics. Oh god, that was a bomb, not a... <laughs> hey, the, so now that you mention it, bomb, now there's something down there. Nothing in here, right? Don't think there's anything else over here that I can see. Trying to get better at platforming. Um, doesn't look like there's anything down here. Horrible joke in the queue. All right. I'm excited. Sorry, I didn't have it open. Roro says, how do we... Wait, how do we know when the Gobi officially becomes dry by desertification? I don't even know. I don't even understand that. <laughs> I know that's a desert, but. Thank you, um, McGeem. Thank you, Meister Crod. Uh, let's see. Anything down here? I don't think so.
I feel like the snow de the snow biome is at least like one of the least deadly biomes. I don't I don't hate traversing in this one. Don't feel like I'm always about to die horribly. Can't see it. Uh, let's crotch one of these plums. Nom nom nom. That looks like a pressure plate right there. I don't see, th oh, the trap is right there too. I see it, okay. Presumably that's it. All right, so we learned something really cool about these pressure plates. And that is when you're holding any of the of this stuff, you can see traps. And I, I wonder if that lets you see any trap, because if so, that's wild. Like, who needs danger sense anymore when we just have that? So um, I'm curious to see if we can use that as a strategy. I wonder if it would show me any traps if there were any right there. Well, there shouldn't be any. Freaking better not be any. All right, ice blade. Let's go. Yeah, learning. Did you see wires? Right, right. Thank you, uh, Trim. Thank you, Sammy. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you, Mobius. I think there are more gems and ice biomes. Interesting. Um. A little bit of early iron is good. As far as me not dying goes. Sometimes a cool sounding or looking weapon is better than the best one. I like the variety, like everything seems pretty good at least. I mean, early game, I'm never like, darn, I got a weapon other than a copper sword. Worth it, I don't think. And why not? Thanks, decoy. Okay, we already got that. Oh my goodness. Uh, let's go back this way. Pressure plate says there's nothing here. Now, are there any traps that don't involve wires? That's a question that I want to know. Hmm. Murderous ice blade. All right, fine. I'll definitely be taking your ice blade. Oh, hi, bearer. Welcome, welcome. Oh, that looked like a whole bunch of ore. What kind of ore is that? How much does the bullet do on this? Oh, in general, this weapon seems pretty nice is that rhetorical um if the trap is one that i've like if it's a trap i've already seen and i've just forgotten i don't mind if someone tells me like if it's just one of the regular traps in the game uh again i'm pretty open i just want to learn more about the game at this point like if anybody has any uh, uh spoilers are only not okay for uh post hard mode, mode stuff or anything that will like specifically apply to that but for pre hard mode stuff, um, I'm down for people to talk about whatever now today. 
Hi, Salian. Welcome. As far as I know, most traps have wires. It seems like they should, based on how they work. Like, if you're not activating something, then it's not a trap. Right? Um, something I want to know about spawn, if anybody knows. Is it possible for traps to spawn above minecart tracks? My thought process is it's not. I've never seen one. I've never once seen it like a boulder that falls onto the path of a minecart. Maybe rarely. Yeah, I know how to use the gravity potions to get to the Sky Islands. Um, I probably should aim the actual thing. I just realized I could sh I'm shooting it like a projectile. I can actually try to hit stuff with it. Um... starting area. We haven't even set up a house yet. <laughs> Bearware, it's okay. You don't have to you don't have to do anything. It's all good. You don't have to make excuses. <laughs> appreciate just having you. Uh oh, Bobby, thank you so much for 11 months. I really appreciate it. So we're, we're holding a pressure, a pressure plate to ensure that there's no wiring here. And we didn't see any wiring. So we should be safe to open the chest. Nice. Got a magic mirror. Off to a pretty darn good start here. Though we need a movement item. We're missing movement items still. Who needs danger sense potions anymore though? What the heck? That's pretty cool. New strats. Piano. <laughs> I wonder how much the piano sells for. Oh, inventory is full. Let's get rid of this copper sword. And these dirt blocks. And let's crunch a plum. Piano counts as a table, and bed, and bed counts as a chair. That's cool to know. Thank you. All right, I think it's time to go home. It's probably gonna be the middle of the night, but YOLO, I guess. Uh, let's build right here. Worm friend. Uh, can I put this in ammo so I can get the star? I'll put it in ammo. Alright, it begins again. That was a cool start. We just need to get some more movement items. I'm probably gonna sell my gems. I literally hoard the gems all game and then never use them. probably do anything with them. We have an ice machine and an extractinator. What a weird start. What a very bizarre start. Uh, 
Uh, there's a statue of a cat that gives a plus five buff. Plus five defense buff. I already know about that one. The bass statue. Yeah, I already know about it. Rain music. My favorite part about the rain, though I love all the music in Terraria, my favorite part about the rain is uh, you get lots of worms. Do you want to know what statues do? Um... Well, if it's like, if it's specifically relevant to hard mode, post hard mode stuff, then probably not. But if it's just like a general game feature that I haven't figured out that, then uh, maybe is it useful? Is it silt and slush. Yeah, I need to. Um, Oh, did we get the rare actual exact number of spaces? 17? 16. Nope. <laughs> All right. Double doors are back. <laughs> double doors are back in business. Uh, the guide was slain. Ah. Double door. Okay. I need to put the chest down so we can um, rip a Rooney. Tanner the guide was slain. Should have been Connor, true guide. Wow, we've opened five chests. Gonna stagger the <laughs> graphics. All right, um, we need to make all sorts of things. Let's put down our loom, our extractinator, and our ice machine. Actually, let's finish the house first. All right, just get these statues out of my inventory. Um, as always, number three will be alchemy. Uh, two will be ore. One will be blocks. Okay, let's finish the house so we can... Oh, I have a question about NPCs moving in. Um, it seems like it's a sort of a random amount of time until NPCs move in. I'm curious how that works exactly. Does anybody know? Um, you used to be able to spawn them much faster for meteorites. Interesting. May as well get that wooden armor going. Doors, table, lots of wall. Extractinator is good. I just, it's just a matter of finding silt, I guess. Or slush. Um, oh, there's a bunch of requirements. 50 silver in their inventory. Interesting. Do they all have just a bunch of different requirements? It always felt a little like... My, my thought process is almost everything in this game is based off of... Like, there's a check mark that the game looks for before it happens. Before, maybe like, before the slime rain starts, before the eye attacks. And I'm wondering if that's going to apply to before, uh, like, Skeletron spawning, or in, in the last game I got the Destroyer instead. Uh, but don't, don't spoil anything about hard mode stuff, though. I'm just, vo I'm just voicing my thoughts on that. Um, a nurse is a player has more than 100 health and the merchant is present. So yeah, the order I notice is always the same, though occasionally I wouldn't get the Demolitionist, and I figured out it's just if you have explosives or not. And then the, uh, the gunsmith always spawns as soon as you break the first, um, whatever it's called, like the first orb. And then you always get a gun drop from that. And then the demolitionist spawns. So I'm guessing the demolitionist in general just needs that. Um, also, can I see if I can make like one little hole through here? What if I stand on the table? Hey! <laughs> so, um, 
Enemies can't seem to attack, and most things can't seem to attack. Melee attacks don't go through one pile gaps, but projectiles can go through one pile gaps, which is interesting. Okay, so we want the uh, merchant to move in because I need to sell stuff. So let's finish up this stuff. Uh, most certain NPCs move in after certain requirements. Yeah, it's like when you defeat a boss, you get. Uh, in general, every time I defeat a boss, more of them seem like they move in. Um, Tiffany Seraph, thank you so much for the three months. Let's see. Uh, sorry, I'm trying to find. Oh, I'm I'm a bad streamer. One second, I don't have uh, my little tracker open. Double, 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 double. Um, Ezzy Dow and Ta. Sorry if I missed you earlier. Thank you very much for the subs. All right. Oh yeah, um, I never got the. Uh, A lot of it focus car gave the okay for pre hard mode hints. So far, I haven't learned anything like game changing though, but a lot of interesting things for sure. Uh, actually, let's maybe do this. Probably make well, I don't know. I might make an underground many things. <laughs> might do more underground shenanigans. Uh, these are both suitable, right? Yeah, I need to make a I wanted to make a stone layer just because it looks better. Let me see if I can find stone real quick, purely for aesthetic purposes. The way the way this game works is as if it wants you to be superstitious. It does definitely um, have a lot of <laughs> a lot of stuff that does feel kind of like that, which I really like. I don't know. It feels very like interesting and mysterious. It's possible to have loadouts. Yeah. Um. I still don't know why I would want to do that, but maybe it'll make more sense at some point. Like, I get the idea of why, but I've never, like, found a practical reason. Because normally I have a best thing, and so I just want to use that best thing. I'm mining this real fast, literally for aesthetic purposes, sorry. <laughs> it's fun to make a house that has a different material for every layer. I do want to sell stuff. Man, I could sell the ice machine for two gold. It might be worth it. <laughs> Does the piano sell? Nah, it doesn't sell super well. Goldfish kite. Oh, that's cute. We'll keep it. Oh yeah, I should try the ice arrows. I never tried them out. I just realized I had 62 bombs this whole time. What am I doing? What am I doing? We could just be doing this. Oh, it's raining out. Hold on. Oh my gosh, I just realized it's raining. We cannot let this opportunity go past us. Goldfish bunnies. There's always more worms that spawn in the rain. Yo, let's go. Just 
the way I went to ice area? Yeah, we gotta check the other way. Oh yeah, these glow stick things spawn during the rain too. Fishing, let's go. All right, we seriously need to find some movement stuff. No spoils. Uh, today we're allowing spoils that are uh, only before hard mode. So only only that involve things I've already beaten. Hi, Tisa. Yeah. I don't know whether the one you were... I don't know whether that spoil was that, though, because I didn't see it. I just want to learn more about the game. Got a new guide. Oh yeah. Um, I want to make gray bricks. How do I? Oh, I need a furnace probably. Let's get our furnace down. Yeah, gray bricks. Oh, I need more. More here. We have rope. Oh, we have lots of rope. Let's go. More explosions. Do 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 do. What's the double door for? For symmetry. Dang it! <laughs> it wouldn't be symmetrical otherwise. Gold. So I guess we have a gold game. Alright, may as well use the last of our bombs and then soon we can afford dynamite. Whoa. It's thundering up there. I gotta go check and see if there's anything to get. Hi, Skull Cat. Uh, spawn. Uh, the King Slime only spawns if you kill 150 slimes during the slime rain. Well, that makes sense. Because he spawns sometimes for us and not others. And I guess I just annihilated a billion slimes sometimes. Thunder is thundering. Wow, that's it's really thundering. Any big trees over here? I need a little bit more wood. I swear I've never heard this music before. I 
Have I had have I ever had a thunderstorm this intense before? I don't even know if I have. Yeah, this is hardcore. I only have played on hardcore. Damn, this music. Exactly three days of your life spent playing this game. Well, it beats the year that I had playing World of Warcraft. Um. Save some fishing craze. Oh, you can open them afterwards? I mean, yeah, that's technically a spoiler for hard mode, but hey. It's a minor one. You could just fish forever and open 200 crates after hard mode. <laughs> Those are the strats right there. Uh, Desert and snow change during snorms. Yeah, I've noticed. It even said we could fight the boss during the snow, but I never, um, I never did. I even looked for it, looking for it, and I didn't. Yeah, please, no information about after hard mode, only just before. Yeah, I just want to know if there's anything about the game that I haven't learned yet, like any, any pre-hard mode stuff, but again, nothing after hard mode. This is a nice fishing area right here. Since it's raining, honestly, maybe we should go fishing. Jeez, the thunder is crazy. Do I have enough iron for a fishing pole? These are the real questions. Nope. <laughs> Didn't I have more than that? Oh, it's in my, I do have more than that, actually. We might be okay. Yeah, that should be enough. The most important purchase. Oh, I don't have an anvil yet. I like to buy it because it saves me a little bit of iron to just buy it. Wow. Yeah, the fishing bowl. The most important object in the game, aka. Uh, let's put on some chain mail. That'll help keep us alive. Good, good. And how are we doing on items? We have a really nice weapon. That's actually super, super nice. Um, let's get a little bit better pickaxe. Why not? Seriously tempted to sell these, but we're so close to getting a grapple, I shouldn't. Alright, we're. Um, I need to build the second floor. Yeah. Let's go ahead and build a second floor so that we can. Uh, get our other NPCs. Allied, we're fishing. Oh, do I have any stars? I do have two stars. While it's raining, okay, can anybody confirm, does fishing in the rain, it feels like you get more loot, or I think, you, I think the bites happen faster? Is that actually true or is that in my head? Cause that's what it feels like. It's actually true, let's go. It's just the same mechanic that's in Minecraft. Increases bite frequency. Yeah, we should definitely go do that real fast then. You can sometimes find water bolt on bookshelves. I, uh, I already, f I did find that already. In fact, I found it twice.
Let's make ourselves. Oh, I need to start making these higher up, don't I? Oh no, is the rain ending? Uh, no, it's still raining, I think. Just a thunderstorm ended? Oh, Iron Crate, easy game. Yeah, I found a lot of statues. I haven't figured out what the statues do yet. It is common. I'll experiment more with the statues. Maybe I just need a hint. Because the bass statue is obvious because it gives you a buff. But the other ones, I've like... I've tried doing everything that makes sense. Like, I've tried mining next to the mining statue and it doesn't do anything. So it's just confusing. Um... What they actually do. for statues is wires oh oh you have to activate them that's interesting oh i should open the crate we might get a better hello bunny what are you doing in there nope terraria redstone interesting res We have a separate time for how long you are fishing. <laughs> There's still a pre harbo biome I haven't found. I found the marble and the granite ones, if that's what you mean, but I didn't explore them. What does bass do? Uh, it, it gets converted to dynamite, <laughs> is what it does. <laughs> Sagan respawn. You familiar with the OG? So based on the music, it's actually daytime right now, right? Even though it doesn't look like it. Oh yeah, but then it just changed. Now I hear the music changed. Thanks, Meta. What the? There's a zombie in there. What are you doing? There's a zombie in there. Okay, well that's enough fishing. Oh, never mind. Six gold. Oh man, it's every time I fish, I'm like, ah, we're not getting anything. And then I just get six gold and I'm like, all right, well. I guess all we're doing ever again is fishing. All right. It's a. Uh... Oh god. Uh, this is fine. Do I have an apple? I do. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh, I want some more stars for more bait. <laughs> I'll take that. And for the inevitable star cannon that we're gonna use once and then never again. Oh, is this jungle? Jungle sucks. Unless I get something really fast, jungle always sucks. Oh my gosh, what is that? Well, I guess we're getting an easy grapple. What is this ore right here? Holy butts. Sapphire times 20 million just sitting here on the surface. The bats are coming for me, though. Stay out. Wow, that was... I have 19 sapphire. Jeez. That's pretty wild. All right, let's get out of here. Let's finish the second floor and finally get uh, our new NPCs coming in. 
kind of platforms. things must be done I think so cool whoa <laughs> that thing just got annihilated oh my goodness 29 bass this is why we go fishing all right for the gold we got like 10 gold from fishing and also um just fish for victory this time <laughs> no uh, let's make a sapphire hook Nice. Very nice. And then I think I'm just going to sell my gems because I never do anything with them after that point. Ever. For any reason. Um, I need like doors and things. Somebody say I can use a piano instead of a um, a table, because that's pretty cool. I thought that was a golden bunny, but it's just the star makes it a little bit lit up. Piano, yeah. I have sunflowers. I need to plant sunflowers. Uh, so the NPCs only move in during the day. I'm assuming that's what the, what's what it is. It's always felt like that. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. Between certain times, too. Interesting. No, that one block is wrong. So is this a suitable housing? It is. That's cool. Alright, nice. I see the double doors have returned. They have. <laughs> Whenever I randomly do something asymmetrical, the double doors come back. <laughs> uh. Ah, why did I scroll like this? Right. Yeah, the enchanted night crawlers are so good. We need to plant more sunflowers. There's some walls missing. I don't see any walls. Oh my gosh, you're right, there are. How did this happen? There we go. Alright, nice. It'd be nice to use the extractinator a lot this game. I feel like we just go and mine for silt or whatever. I wonder if there's a higher chance of finding the snow version or the the one down here. It all kind of balances out. Put housing materials here for now. 
We should go get some clay for some pots soon. I think I'm gonna make an underground garden this time. Yeah. Sounds like a nice idea. Not seeing many owls. I never saw how much the owls sell for. We should <laughs> get an owl pet. Making these corner jumps is so hard in this game. Man, 11 silver. <laughs> we keep the pressure plate though, so we can see the wires. Hello, how are you? Why are there two doors? <laughs> it's asymmetrical otherwise. What does the merchant do? They go to nice home, new homes, I'm sure. Alright, let's, let's begin the underground garden. Ah yes, my Carl box is back. Carl box. Oh, I did not mean to click achievements. Where did my pots just go? I just annihilated them. There they are. Hotel Carl. <laughs> uh, yeah. Use the mining potion more than never. 